Agent 1, you will receive your mission when you find a spot without Etisalat network coverage. Roger that. Etisalat, you've met your match. detected. Get to a remote spot. Roger that. Still have coverage. Oh. oh my. What are you doing? Get to the next spot. <sighs> Agent One, can you hear me? Crystal clear, unfortunately. I beg your pardon. <sighs> There's signal everywhere! Where can we possibly go? Agent One. <laughs> you still have coverage. Oh no! Come back! Come back! for listening and enjoy the film. want to, um, no? Okay. <sighs> John, show us how it's done. Oh. 
Lighthouse sneakers. Shungdi, how are you? I'm really good. You're not you when you're hungry. Sneakers, get some nuts.
This is it, sir. Excellent. Nine minutes, then. Nice pair of binoculars, sir. Mm-hmm. They're uh, not service issue. Certainly not. They're Austrian. Oh. Barclay card, is it, sir? What? Did you get them on your Barclay card, sir? And why should I want to do a thing like that? Well, sir, you get a hundred days free insurance. Yes. Well, in case... In case they get stolen? And who's going to steal them, exactly? Are we about to be mugged by a gang of delinquent haddock? You could always lose them, sir. Lose them in a five-foot dinghy? Oh, dear, I've lost my binoculars. Oh, no, there they are under the seat. You got your damage, sir? But will you shut up about Barclay Card? You couldn't damage a pair of binoculars in here if you tried. So, let's hear no more about Barclay Card. You see, a man in my experience knows that when he's got a pair of binoculars... <laughs> Sir? That's not a rug buff. It is a Bedouin birthing blanket. Tradition has it, a powerful aid to fertility. Great! I'll get me mum one. The Barclay card? Put it away, buff. The Tuareg are an ancient people. They respect only hard cash and hard bargaining. Ah, shamali duck duck. Thank you. You sound fluent, sir? We are both fluent, buff. Sadly, in different languages. How much is the rug? <laughs> so, where did your Barclay card get you? Well, it got me reg insured for the next three months. Insurance, Bob. I think I can handle the rug. Ah, smell those Tuareg campfires. Unmistakable. Look, shoot, push off. Okay, so you're here to audition for a part in the British Airways Safety Information video. Can you just look into the camera and give your name, please? Hi, I'm Chua Talagio 4 And have you done any safety videos before? No, only feature films. Well, this could be your big break, okay, mate? So don't mess it up. Shall we get one in the can, guys? Now listen, Chua Tell, there's going to be an auto cue, so you don't have to learn the lines, you just read them. <laughs> okay, focus. <clears throat> okay, action! Hello. We will now demonstrate the safety features on this aircraft, and your attention is essential, as these may differ from any aircraft that you've flown on before. Hmm, bit of a show off. Take care your hand baggage does not block the aisles or exit. It must be put under the seat in front of you or in an overhead locker. Place items in the locker carefully as they may fall out and injure someone, especially if it's a bag full of duty-free goods, darling. Actually, sorry, that was meant for Joanna Lomley. Muppet. Sorry. In the case of an evacuation, you must move quickly to the closest usable exit, taking absolutely nothing with you. And I mean nothing, sweetie. Yeah, that's another one of her lines. F me. You. <clears throat> Sorry, um, action. All exits are clearly marked and are being pointed out to you now. Please take a moment to locate your nearest exit, bearing in mind this may be behind you. Wow, that was beautiful. Oh, thanks. I'm um, not seriously, that bit about the nearest exits, really powerful. Please carry on, Tandy. 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 Sorry. Opening the doors automatically inflates the evacuation slides. And remember, high heeled shoes must be taken off as they may tear the slide. God, no way. Designer shoes, like me. <laughs> We're so like soulmates. We should, we should hang. No. Cool. If the cabin air supply fails, oxygen will be provided. Masks like this will appear automatically. Stay in your seat and pull the mask towards you. Place the mask over your mouth and nose like this and breathe normally, adjusting the band to secure it. Please note that the bag may not inflate. In all the washrooms, club world and first cabins, you may need to pull on the colored streamer to release the mask. And please, please, do make sure your own mask is fitted before helping anyone else. That was so wonderful. Oh. You, you know, you'll get the pearls. Do you think so? I hope so. Next! Right, pay attention, please. Your life jacket is underneath or beside your seat. If required, please remove the jacket from its container and pull it over your head. Pass the tapes around your waist and tie them securely in a double bow at the side, and thus a double bow. To inflate, pull the red toggle as shown. 
When you see a red toggle, that's definitely the toggle to tug. Now, the air in this rather wonderful jacket can be topped up by using this neat little mouthpiece. There's also a charming whistle and light combination for attracting attention, should you be one of those people who enjoys attention. And please, fairly obviously, do not inflate your lovely life jacket until you've actually left the aircraft. At which point, toggle up, inflate away, and whistle all you like. Okay, so Jim, I'll read the line, and then when I do the nod, you do the action. Okay, yeah. Okay, please now ensure that your seat is upright and in the takeoff position, with armrest down. Your footstool and video screen are stored if you have them, and your table is folded away. Genius! Look, I've got goosebumps. Is that it? Just, just the tray table? That's it. And you smashed it. Oh. Well, I suppose it would have a certain je ne sais quoi. <laughs> Thank you. In the unlikely event of the aircraft having to make an emergency landing, you will be told to adopt this protective brace position. If facing rearwards in club world, you must adopt this position. If you have any questions, please ask your cabin crew. Great, very intense. I love the sour face. Maybe we could try the next bit just a little less serious. Less serious? Just chill out, mate, really. You know, maybe if you just move your head, actually. Just... No, no, it's fine. Uh, okay. You got it? Yeah, yeah, exactly. So we can see the beautiful smile. Very radiant. But it's not X-Files. There's no, there's no aliens about. It. Just chill out, yeah? Thank you. Brilliant. Thank you, Gillian. Action. You'll also find the Flying Start donation envelope in your seat area. So if you've got any spare change in any currency, find it, take it out, and put it in the envelope. Please. Spot on. OK, that's a wrap. On behalf of British Airways, Comic Relief and Flying Start, thank you for your attention and your kind donations. Every penny of which will help children all over the world. Living really tough lives. If you have any questions or you can't find your safety card... Or Flying Start envelope... Please, ask one of your gorgeous cabin crew members. Have an enjoyable flight. <laughs>